here we go we've got our cavity trays in and we're starting building up from the damp course as you can see we started Cavity trays are all put in. Damp proof membrane is wrapped up onto the first block. And weepers in, as you can see here, to take the water out. We've got to do overhang on this side because for now to get it above the, the uh, fence panels. And then we can all right, when Matty loads our side out, then I can go on the other side then. That's it. So this is how it is. Well, you... uh, he, he stood there as a model from Kay's catalog at the minute. Measured got them in line so when you're coming down the path you can see they're in line but now I'm just running in simple you have to make sure with these bricks I just run my thumb up and just feel that they're the right way that way's smooth that way's rough so you know they're upside the right way just lay into the line Just a gentle push, leading with the hand. If your mortar's just a nice right consistency, you don't have to tap. Sometimes if the mortar's a bit dry or gone off a little bit, you have to tap them down. But this is just how you do it. You just gentle push like that. Then you go. We're not going dead fast today. We're just showing you how, how to do it. And this is how we, uh, we do our constructions of the extensions. Just a little tap. Yeah. Not, smash, not smashing it down. Yeah, don't smash it. Don't put a trowel rash. Obviously, keep your corner plumb. Okay. Obviously, come down to your opening. That brick's tipping forward a touch. Make sure we're plumb. There we go. And then we range through. Get the bricks back. There we go. And last but not least, always check your opening for plumb. Nothing worse than putting the window in and your reveals are out of plumb. Let's double check that, Chris. Here we go. Okay, guys. Try and get better than bang on. There you go. How's that? That'll do.
start today. Trying to keep the cement off the spots. And off to quick. And what we've done, notched it like this. And so it's just a simple notching and that goes along there. That will be bedded on and the uh, it's taking shape now and coming on. Just bedding the wall plate on. This is how we do it. Gives it a cushion takes out any discrepancies and gets it dead level and then they will be strapped on. And it's notched like that and so that's notched on top of that and sits nicely level and nice and plumb right through looking good. Ready for the rafters now. That's the next job. Rafters. As we said, we're all ready to go. 